Governor Ron DeSantis was today handing out checks to first responders in Jacksonville. This money part of statewide bonuses for fire, police and EMT personnel. The governor announced the bonuses today at Craig Municipal Airport. Tia Collins was there. She's on your side joining us live now to tell us more about the governor's goal with this money. Atia. This is the third year in the row in a row that the governor has authorized these $1,000 bonuses for first responders across the state. It's a move that he hopes will help with retention and attract more first, first responders here to the state of Florida. Now, members from both JSO and JFRD were there today. They received the first 40 of these checks from the governor himself. After the awards, the governor responded to recent comments made yesterday on a national level by House of Representatives Speaker Kevin McCarthy. Now, McCarthy said he predicts Donald Trump will win the 2024 Republican presidential primary race and that DeSantis is, quote, not on the same level. DeSantis laughed before explaining that he would bring changes that Trump wasn't able to do, like reduce the nation's debt. Take a listen. I am not somebody uh, who the D.C. establishment wants to see up there. There's no question about that because they know that a lot of things will be changing if I'm there. The governor was also asked about his focus for the upcoming legislative session, and he said health care and making costs affordable will be one of his top priorities. Reporting in Jacksonville, Tia Collins, First Coast News, on your side.